Welcome back to Tripa's Garage. I'm Austin, and today is a little different as you can tell. We're not working on the car, but I am super excited that I get to share with you a new product, the Tripa's Garage 2JZ GE Dual Trigger Kit. This kit allows you to use a factory turbo GTE ECU on your 2JZ GE, essentially turning your non-turbo engine into the turbo version. Let's take a closer look at the sensor bracket. All brackets are designed, machined, and assembled within the USA, and all come with a gorgeous black anodized finish. All hardware will be included with this kit, literally making it a complete bolt-on option for your 2JZ. The rear bracket will come pre-assembled as shown. As you may have noticed, its shape mimics that of the serpentine belt tensioner and is designed to mount on top of the tensioner with the three bolts provided. Once the rear bracket is secure, install the sensor bracket with the two flat bolts provided. Remember, when using the OEM ECU, you do need to run the lower crank sensor and the lower timing gear. It's the 12th tooth one for this non-VVTi ECU. Let's say you decide at a later time you want to upgrade and you want to get a standalone unit instead of using a factory ECU. You can use this too. Most of the time, uh, standalone ECU units, they only require one cam sensor input. Keep that in mind, you're not only limited to the factory ECU with this. This just allows you to be able to use a factory ECU on your non-BBTI. What this also means is that now you can use any ECU ever made for the 2JZ non-BBTI for the past 30 years they've ever been made. Let's head out to the garage and I'll show you what it looks like on. If you're in need of this kit, head on over to threebazgarage.com to pick one up today. If you like what you saw, go ahead and hit that like, subscribe button, let me know what you thought about this video in the comments, what you'd like to possibly see in the future. And again, I just wanna say thank you to all of you out there who support me. I couldn't have done it without you and you all make this possible for me. So again, thank you very much for the love and support. I'll keep on making those videos as long as you're around to watch them. You have a good one.